Hey Gems and welcome back to May Chronicles. In this video, I will be showing you guys how I got a high lift extra extra blonde hair color. It's not 613, but it's like basically close to it. So guys, this is a full lace cap. As you can see, it is 14 inches straight. The only reason it doesn't look straight is because I did a video earlier on how to curl short hair. Make sure you go watch that if you haven't already. But we're going to get into this video. Initially, I was going for the Black Roots Blue Ombre. But then I decided to just bleach it a second time and keep it blonde. I may end up re it. But, well, I may end up dyeing it, adding a color dye to it. But as of right now, I'm going to wear it blonde. And I think it's super cute. So follow me and let's get to it. I did add toner. The toner that I used was the Clairol High Lift blonde no i think it was called the highest lift blonde and honestly that helped a lot if you're just using the regular bleach whether it be the best bleach it still won't become that bright bright blonde that you're probably trying to get unless you use a toner If you've been keeping up with my videos, you know that I like a more liquidy consistency, especially when I'm trying to get the entire wig a certain blonde or a really light color, because the more liquid it is, the easier it is to spread across the wig rather than it be really a thick consistency, then it's like you really have to take more time in my opinion, but it's more so a preference thing. This is how it looked after the first bleach. I think it came out good, but then that's when I changed my mind and said that I wanted to just do an entire wig that's blonde. So I went back and re-bleached it. So yeah, I'm very satisfied with this color, like even with the roots, but I have a wig that's already 14 inches with the black roots blonde hair. It's much blonder than this because it's a 613, but yeah, so I decided to just continue bleaching it and that's when I bleached the roots and uh, y'all will see that. I actually kept it on longer this time and I wanted the top to be brighter than the bottom, so I started at the top as you guys will see. And here is the final results. I feel like if I had it in better lighting, y'all would see how bright it is, but my lights haven't came, so therefore I won't be able to show you guys exactly how bright it is, but trust me, it is really a really close shade to 613. Y'all will see it in one of my vlogs very soon. 